Hello, souls and demons, and welcome back. Today's story is called The Town, written by Leah of Alexandria. And if you're new here to the show, we share some amazing horror stories, both the fictional kind and the real kind. If that sounds like it's up your alley, stick around and show us some love. And with that, everyone sit back, grip your seats, and enjoy the show. You look weary. You've been traveling for a long time, haven't you? You already know what this place is. It's home. You found what you've been looking for. You can have it all, too. All you have to do is remember. This has always been where you belong. This place is yours. Just remember. There's people here. Your people. You still have your sanity. But we can tell that would not be for long. Let me show you the people who still have their energy. This is the town you were looking for. It's the perfect size for you. You'll remember. Let's take a walk. You see the corner store, where you used to drop your bikes off outside with your friends as you all ran in to grab various candies. You always told Tom not to eat too much chocolate, but he never listened. At least you weren't the one with the belly aches later. There's the Anderson Bakery, where Mr. and Mrs. Anderson worked your entire life. You can smell the pastries now. Remember you used to leave off of campus during lunch and buy an apple fritter the size of your head? You've never tasted anything like it, even up to this very moment. But it can be yours again. You just have to remember. Ignore the faint smell of ash. Ignore the mold. It only exists when you see it, or think about it. Speaking of school, you remember how many good memories you have? It can be yours again. Remember 7th grade when you met Rachel Van? She was the first girl that really liked you. You didn't know much at the time. You'll remember. Remember you used to pass notes every single day waiting to read it on the bus on your way home. It was what you looked forward to all day. I wonder what Rachel is doing now. You can find out. She's here, you know. In time, I can show you to her. Wouldn't she be excited to see you? She still has her energy. Not like the outside. There's no escape from here. Why would you ask? We're all so old here. We need new blood like you. Someone to return this place to. The warm feeling you get right now will always be there. You don't ever need to be afraid again. You don't have to remember how it used to be. Just remember how it is. Stop being afraid. It's all over now. You found the home you always needed. Ignore the mold. It isn't harmful if you don't think about it. There are only friends here. Remember that. Remember the light that always shined here. You were born here and will never die again here. Put your satchel down. There's no need for that anymore. Everything has been taken care of. Don't go to the center of town. There is nothing there. Keep looking forward. Here's the park. We had to move the gazebo. It was getting too hot. Other than that, you can remember what it used to look like. You would meet there before the movie. You have to remember to make it yours. The Tivoli Theater used to show mold every Friday and Saturday. Movie. That's what I said. The grass in the park was the greenest patch in the land. It wasn't diseased and yellow. That's just a trick. It can be yours again. Like this entire place. Just remember. 
Every summer you would pack up the wagon and present at the market in that very park. Biggs was there. Freddy was there. You even met the Count. They're all still here somewhere. You'll meet them again. You'll meet every single one of them again. The town hasn't forgotten you. Don't forget the town. Not one better place in the rooms exists. No pain, no hunger, no famine, no flames. There's your friend's house. The one you used to ride bikes with until the lights turned red. He doesn't eat chocolate anymore. He doesn't eat anything anymore. Remember his parents would get you both pizza and let you watch regular scary movies. You'll remember. He may be harder to find, but you will. You'll find them all. We're so happy you found your home. This is the nicest home anyone can ask for. Sometimes the mold appears when you don't think of it. This won't happen often anymore. The longer you stay, you're going to love it here. It's better than where you have been. You've been traveling for so long. Tattered clothes and bones showing through your skin. You only thought of death, and now you can think of life. You can see your people again. You don't need light. You don't need pain. Only if you want. Remember this place. Let's keep moving. There's the statue we worship. There's the statue we erected outside of the glorious city hall. You remember. The beast of the level. We tamed it. We learned from it. We remember. You remember. Oh, so many people aren't lucky enough to live here. Why are you unhappy? No, there are no exits there. There's a hardware store that old Jim works at. He gave you popcorn and let you take pop out of glass bottles for free while your father picked up supplies. Supplies for the bad times that are no longer needed. You don't need to remember that because it is long over. You need to remember the people of this place. You will become it. We need the young skin. It's getting so old old here. Skin is a small price to pay for this beautiful place. The only hotel in town. It was always well kept. No mold. People came from all over town. Important people. People not from town. I may be getting ahead of you. Don't remember that. The saloon next door was where your mother liked. You had your first glass of peach there, remember? You miss your mother, I know. You played on that gaming machine for hours there. You were never happier. Until right now. You'll remember. There's your house. I know you didn't live here, but you did. It's the same house you lived in. Your unnamed siblings grew up there with you. You won't remember now. You will, with the town's help. You played together, read stories together, and laughed. You haven't laughed in a long, long time, have you? Father was at store and mother was at the saloon. They didn't know the mold used to be there. There is no mold anymore. All you have to do is forget the mold. The fire has also been moved. The center of town has been moved. There is nothing to see there. No doors. No exits. No burning hell. Your neighbor's skin used to fall off if you looked at her. People buried their past near you. It's not like that here. The town has been preparing for you. All bad has been molded. All bad has been removed. Remember? Remember how nice the school was? Remember how nice the park was? Remember how nice the yard was? They will be there when you die. They will be there when you mourn. I will be there when you die. 
I will be there when your family mourns. They are here, though. It doesn't have to be like this. Or that. Do you see the activity field? You used to use it with your friends. You didn't know this at the time, but you wouldn't be doing this forever. No one told you. You can go back. You can keep your skin and quell the fire for the rest of eternity. No one told you it was over. The sky has gone light again. Remember. Remember how you felt doing the activity. No, there is no mold there. If you stop thinking about it, it will cease. The smell of burning light and smoke is not there anymore. This place, like all places, will be yours. Hell. 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 Look in front of you. Do not look behind. Behind only will bring you pain. Pain is not here. The only thing behind you is the people. They will stand behind you if you remember. They will not be in the center. We surround the town. We will put you in the center. You will never be placed into the center. This is the greatest place in the rooms. This is home. Smell the air. Ignore the mold. There is no judgment here. There is no God here. You can be God here. We want you to remember this place because it is you. You can control the mold and the rot. Your skin will forever be yours. But continue to ignore the mold. It does not exist here if you do not think about it. We've all become so grateful that you found the nicest place in existence. There's the corner store. Remember when you rode your bike there on a cold morning? The cold so cold it burned your skin and chapped your lips. Your friend died there trying to escape. You don't have to remember that. It never happened. The smell of blood comes from the Anderson Bakery. Remember Mr. and Mrs. Anderson's bright red eyes watching you as you passed by. You always loved the Anderson's Eve fritters. Speaking of original sin, there's the school. Remember in the seventh grade when you met Rachel Van? The spawn that actually liked your dreadful soul. She still does. You ingrate. I can show you to her. Her skin might not be on. The center of town does not exist. Stop asking if there are any exits. Everyone is friendly here. Everyone is here for you. How many times do I have to tell you that this is your home? Everyone and everything will take care of you. The park is coming up. Yes, yes, it is yellow but it can be green again with your help. All you have to do is stay and make it normal. The normal grass color. The gazebo had to be moved. It doesn't matter where it went or what it leads to. You'll never find it anyway. Can you feel the heat? I think you've been here long enough. Shh. Please. Please, be quiet. I know you've been fighting this for so long. I've watched your every move since you've been here. Your skin is already lifting. There's no use resisting anymore. Stop thinking of the mold. How many times did we have to tell you? You belong here. The center of town does not exist. The center of town does not exist. Good. Good. Now, look around. Look behind you. They are all there. The rust is slowly fading. The smell, it's fading. 
thought is fading. Good. You've taken. You've remembered. This place is now your home, as it always was. It wasn't always, but it was. You are part of this home. This place is your home. Welcome. Do you now have anything to say? I am home. <laughs>